Hey guys, what's up? It's me, and this is Red vs. Blue. Another two videos, one day, probably. Um, I'm sorry that about, I was behind on this one. I was out of town, um, so I wasn't able to do the last one. And then with Cosplay Crunch, I just ended up not having time to do it when I thought I was. Um, also, another apology, because my microphone system is still not fixed. Um, granted, it's only been 20 minutes since I recorded my last video, but I was messing with it, and I still couldn't get it to work, so I'm thinking I'm just going to have to like, restart my computer and just do a bunch of inner stuff, and hopefully I won't have to buy a new mic. But... And so I'm back to using my headset, so I apologize in advance for any shitty audio that you guys may get as a result. Um, this is, this is episode 11. I'm concerned. I'm very concerned, because if you guys remember, if you guys remember last video, you, you know how I took that. Um, so the, the whole thing for this one is, blocked by the reds and blues, Dylan decides to try to seek answers on her own, Sarge finally gets a shot at stardom. That's concerning. Sargedom. Sargedom. I wrote it as Sargedom in my head. I'm just gonna say that from now on. So, I don't know how many episodes are in this season. I'm kind of afraid, because I, I know that Ruby is twelve is usually like 12, 13 episodes, um, and Red vs. Blue is usually over, like, more like 20, but I'm still afraid. Like, I know this definitely isn't the last one, because uh, there's one more waiting for me to watch in my queue to go have go up on video tomorrow uh, on YouTube, and then there's one that's gonna be shown at RTX, and I probably that's either gonna be the last one or the one after it. I really have no idea. Um, I'm just really concerned. I don't think I can handle Washer Carolina dying. I really can't. I already lost one green-eyed redhead. I can't lose another one. I already lost Pro Precious Baby Project Freelancer Wash. He's only bit, he's only just now starting to come back to us. He's finally dealing with that trauma. They're both finally starting to move on. I don't think I can handle it if they die when they're starting this whole new like emotional arc in their lives. I don't think I can handle that. I'm just gonna have to like sit there. Like I, I honestly don't like. I'm scared to watch this because I'm scared that things will get worse. Apparently, it's really funny, but at this point, it's like I don't. You know what? Everything is funny in Red vs. Blue most of the time. It'll be like ha 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 dildos, and then the very next second, it's like oh someone's dead. So I'm concerned. I'm very concerned. Um, God. Oh God. Let's just. Let's just do this. You know the story of Jonah. Oh no. It does ring a bell. Was that on the blacklist? <laughs> the Bible, actually. Jonah was swallowed whole by a whale. Belly of the beast, huh? Sounds like this Bible ripped off aliens. I feel a bit like Jonah right now. But this whale has secrets. I don't know about you, but I am sick of being sidelined. Oh, are we gonna do some snooping around? No. I'm gonna do some snooping around. Aw, oh, come on. I, love you, I can Jax, totally help. I don't know if you've noticed, but I am pretty good at randomly bumping into things that help move the plot forward. You have a more important <laughs> job than I need you to distract someone while I have a look around. I think the blues and reds have Sarge spying on us. No! -uh. <laughs> I mean, uh, I was just walking by. I didn't hear you say exactly what you said just now. See you later. Bye, I gotta go. Woo! God, same. I think you may be onto something. <laughs> Hey there, Mr. Sarge. Sarge, have you ever considered a life in show business? Oh no. Ha! That's ridiculous. Show business is a young man's game. And I was an old man when your old man was a young man. Young man? Well, not necessarily. What? Uh, some people do get into it late. At the later. Well, despite my chiseled frame and iconic eyebrows, I, I am a soldier. Not a movie star. You know, you remind me of R. Lee Ermey. He was a Marine, a real one like you. He was consulting on Full Metal Jacket and was so good that Kubrick cast him in the actual film right then and there. Really? Like actually Ain't a thing? that a wing dinger? I happen to be writing a military drama myself. But if you're not interested, I can check with Serge. Apparently, he studied at Juilliard. Bolt! Now, oh. don't you go putting That's words That's one of my buttons. I didn't say I wasn't interested. Now. What exactly did you say this movie is about? It's a military court drama about a drill sergeant who has to defend himself in court after an accident during a drill gets his whole squad killed. Sounds fantastic! Sounds uh, like Blasius well, in the Red vs. Blue. I'm griff dying horribly during routine training exercises. When can I see the script? Script? Of course! I, I mean, once you have the part, of course, of course, there's an audition first. It's like a screen test, you know, screen test, audition test, train test, you see in front of the camera test. All right, all right, I'll give it a shot. Firstly, <laughs> I always seen myself playing the 30-something CEO of some exciting internet startup. 
Yeah, I think that's gonna be a bit of a stretch. Why don't we stick to what you know? Lights. Camera. Sorry. Power. Yes! Sorry, Tartar. That is some slow walking. Also, seeing red armor with a blue visor is just very upsetting in my core. Oh god, seeing any of it with a blue visor! God, that- I know it's not Donut. I know it's not Donut, but like, it just- it feels wrong. I'm sick of them! So sick of them I could puke! I know! I'm also, trying. I love the- I'm just- I'm- Water I'm trying! Splash. Try harder, fuckface! When will it be done? Oh, you know, soon? Soon! Yeah, soon. Soon. Probably. Probably! Hello! Probably? Probably? What the fuck, Loco? I've given you everything you've asked for. You said it would be ready months ago! Well, the quantum capacitors are working. The Flux Matrix is inverting the matter states, but I still can't get the neutron dispenser to pull out the antimatter and I'm out of the way batteries. Stop! I can't stand the fucking techno babble! But it, why couldn't you just build me a huge freaking bomb like I asked? This is going to be so much better! It's gonna be perfect. It's gonna be big and beautiful, and you're going to love it! And we're gonna be best friends. And it's going to be finished soon, or you are. Got it? It'll be finished by the- Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. I was gonna say, this is why you don't leave soda cans lying around, but I literally just knocked over a soda can getting yes! ready for it. It's you! Oh, you're in trouble now! <laughs> Should I arrest what? the boss? I'm telling you, Tucker, I know what I heard. That's definitely not a cloaking device. Oh, shit. Well, then what is it? I don't know, but it most definitely shows that they're not being honest with us. Maybe they just don't trust the press. I can't blame them there. I'm not some reality TV producer, okay? I promise I didn't leave that bounty hunter to you. Can we please bury the hatchet and just focus on what's important? They haven't given me one single reason not to trust them. They've given you more than one single reason. Dark about what's going on. They're not. Look. They left me in charge of planning the campaign against the UNSC. That's a video game. What? No, it's a tactic simulator. Look, advanced military stuff. That's a video game, Tucker. Huh. <laughs> well, I guess that explains the microtransactions. They're distracting oh you. We're Carolina and Wash. I heard they've joined up with us. They're out getting some grub. She told you that? Dibble did. You're seriously going to tell me nothing about this place smells fishy to you? Of course <laughs> it smells fishy. Figuratively, Tucker. Figuratively fishy. Almost all the doors around here are locked. I can't find a single computer that's networked. If they were really being so open, why all the secrecy? I wouldn't want a bunch of random people running around my house either. They might steal shit or walk into my masturbatorium. Ugh. What if it's more than that? What if there's stuff they don't want us to see? <sighs> you know, I don't need your help. I just thought you should know. Please. Temple's <laughs> office. What about it? He has a network computer. I've seen it. Bingo. Let me know what you find, all right? Of course. Thank you! Okay, we ready? God! Sarge, did you choose a monologue? Of course I'm nervous! Thank I God mean, for the ready. voice of reason. I mean, of course I'm ready. Like, I just... Well, ready then. I will like, get in position. Um, Temple was the one that had, like, the, the little worm of that idea in his head. I want her to be the... Where it's like, where is Wash? Oh my God. Oh God. Remember, it's... No bastard ever won a war by dying for his country. He won the war by making the blue bastard die for his country. Now... Should we win today, the 4th of July will no longer be known as an American holiday, but as the day the world stood up in one voice and said, you may take our lives, but you'll never take our truth. You want the truth? You can't handle the truth. Second place, set of steak knives. Third place, martini. Shaken, not stirred. Good. That was great take. Uh... He's dead, Jim. You're a wizard, Harry. Feel lucky, punk. Say what again? Over the line. Hasta la vista. A great big bushy beard. This is my boomstick. How am I doing? I think we're losing the thread. Dancers of Wolves. City Slingers. Predator. Laser Team 2. Those are just titles, Sarge. And I'm pretty sure you made that last one up. Ah. Right. So, did I get the part? Why don't we try some improv? I have a better idea. Uh... Where's the reporter? In her corner, sir! Wrong. They're empty. You, Shutterbug, tell me where she is. Have you gentlemen ever considered a life in show business? Show business? Oh, uh, shit. I, I, I don't know, I swear. Oh, shit. Shit. Shit! <sighs> Are you not expecting a password? Vic. Vic. 
God damn it, Vic. I knew it! <laughs> Vic.exe. Yo, 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 yo! V-I-C-K, what is up, Chica Mosfina? Quiet. I need help. Ho-ho! Well, your wish is my command, Dudorino. This genie is popping off that bottle and ready to roll. What you need? Access to this computer. Can you hack in? Dunzo! Wait, little reminder to do that. You've got three little wishes before you've got to control alt delete me off the face of reality. That was the deal. Yeah, yeah, I haven't forgotten. Yeah, and this is wish number, uh, uh, wish number. <laughs> Seems like I got a little, uh, dap in the memory circuits, a little, uh, eraser in the cabeza, huh? Uh, this is wish number. Wish number two. Right! <laughs> this is wish number dos! You oh promised you, Dudorito! I don't want to stand up my date to death. We're taking the river sticks to Disneyland! I'm doing shots with Anubis, dude! I'm playing Twister with the Reaper! Keep your voice down. Do you have a silent mode or something? <laughs> that works. Knock it off. Are you in? Oh, God. You anything? That's disgusting. What is it? A version of what does that mean? <laughs> oh my god. Dylan! Oh, oh no. Shit. Why am I not surprised? I think it's about time we had a little chat. Same! No, no, don't do. What did I say? I said, God. Mm. The blurry ruby in the corner is my exact emotion right now. Like, I knew, like there was no way she wasn't going to get caught. There was no way that she wasn't going to get caught. But that doesn't mean that I wanted her to get caught. God damn it. So, okay, so, okay, okay, okay. So she knows that Wash and Caroline are missing. So that's something. Because, she, like, she knows that they were told that they were regrouped, but they, she hasn't seen them. So that's already something. And she told that to Tucker, so Tucker's definitely gonna check that out. And Tucker knew she was going to the office. Tucker knew she was gonna go to the office, and because of that, if she's if he's like, oh, well, you know, she's gone, she's gone, she didn't, well, oh, she, you know, she left, she wanted to did, she wanted to do something. He will know. The thing is, they have to do this stealthily in such a way that they don't give away the fact that they don't trust them anymore. And I don't like this. I don't like this. I mean, I love this. This season, like, the writing has really been like amazing, and I'm honestly like. I'm, whoever is writing this, just like bless your fucking soul. Uh, but like, also please keep them alive. Jesus. Um. Oh God, I'm concerned. I have many concerns. I have a lot of concerns about this episode. Um. Fuck. Also, props to Dylan, but also fuck you, Dylan. Like erasing his memory after the three wishes repeatedly. Just like I can understand why she wants to keep him around, but at the same time, that's kind of really fucked up. Like. It's kind of really fucked up, man. Like, I realize, I realize she's a reporter and she's doing what she has to do to get the story. She's doing what she has to do to make sure that the Reds and Blues have their name cleared to figure out what's really going on here. And, like, maybe after that she'll delete Vic, but it's like, it's fucked up, man. Fuck! God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. I also still really want to cosplay Dylan at RTX, but I couldn't find any files for her armor, and now I'm just sad. Oh god, I wanna know what's going on with Washington Carolina and I'm afraid. I'm afraid. I'm very afraid. And then someone told me that apparently um they just were working comp on a scene that I'm gonna really enjoy. Which I hopefully mean it's like a Carolina wash fight scene that's gonna be at RTX during the RVD panel, I think. Um I'm afraid for that, but also like yes please. I want my two favorite freelancers to kick some ass! Aggressively. Like, season 13 style. <laughs> Clapping. God, I'm just- Is that meme dead yet? I don't know. But- oh, I don't like this! I don't like this! Ah, I have concerns. I'm gonna go scream in the corner. So, I will see you guys in the next video. And hopefully, hopefully, no one will be dead. But, you know, I really can't tell anymore. So hopefully we'll find out then. So I will see you guys. I hope you guys have a great week and... Uh -huh.